you don't uh, leave your country unless you have to leave and um, unfortunately war uh, is one of the most important aspects that a lot of parents because of their uh, kids future and because of their own safety they, they leave that country and try to seek a safe haven in other places so uh, my family they found a safe haven in Iran um, it was the nearest country that time to, uh, to travel and to be and we were speaking kind of like the same language so that was a place for them I mean again although you face backlashes but if I weren't able to be in Iran, I wasn't able to get that good education and uh, be that uh, more well-spoken and outgoing person. Imagine if I was in Afghanistan during the Taliban regime or during the Soviet. There's no future in war. So that's why people leave their hometown because they want to seek a better future. And if we turn our back to them, we are actually killing hope we are killing an opportunity, we are killing a, a person who can um, contribute to the world in a, in, a, in a way that she or he wants. Refugees are not here to take opportunities from you. They, I wasn't there in Iran to take a place someone else. I was just who I was and I tried to contribute as much as I can. So if we think about that, refugees can actually be the potentials of future CEOs, future doctors, engineers, anyone who can contribute to the community. Um, so. Uh, so that's what I hope that people understand that we are not here to take your job, your opportunity. We are here to be part of this uh, community and uh, together collaborate and just work for a better world.